Hey guys, welcome to Spirit Animal Survival, SAS for short. This is a pre-beta early access game that came out on Steam a couple of weeks ago. Uh, the really cool thing about this game is that there's only three devs. That's it. Just three people. And the amount of stuff that they've been able to actually do so far is pretty dadgum cool. So let's go ahead and get started. I want to test it out. Basically, the setting is an open world multiplayer that's got PvP and co-op. It's a survival game. You get to build, craft, tame, ride, uh, fly, explore wildlife. There's dinos and dragons, as well as horrific creatures. I'm guessing that's mythological. Uh, and then instances of the ability to morph into a spirit animal. That is probably the coolest part, the thing that I'm most looking forward to. So let's go ahead and jump into this character creation, get on a server, and see where we go from here. Alrighty, I, I've got to say already, the music for this game is absolutely beautiful. Seriously, it's beautiful. Let's go ahead and create my character. Okay. All right, here we go. Character name. I thought I just did that. That's fine. Masonator. Beautiful. Okay, hair. Can I turn my character? I cannot. Uh, what's the female character? Oh, okay. All right. It's bald. <laughs> I kind of like that, though. There's a lot of uh, default haircuts and stuff that they usually stick on characters in games like this, and it's nice to be able to see just bald straight off. Uh, so you get a really good idea for head shape and things like that. I love character creation. I love it. The more details, the better. Even if I never see my character, I know I did a good job, and it's going to look good for everybody else. Okay, so hairstyles. Whoa. Okay. All right. Not bad. Not bad. I kind of like this one. I do. Mm, yeah. Mm, no, I'm thinking this one is probably going to be good now skin color okay it's pretty bright this pretty gray it's pretty green <laughs> let's go with uh i'm thinking that one hair color let's do brown eye color let's do red actually you know what let's do uh let's do white that'd be kind of cool now here we go body height whoa okay that's uh that's really really tall but <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's amazing. Okay, uh, it doesn't look like it's proportionate. Well, I mean, it kind of is. Kind of. That's okay. Uh, body weight. Tiny. Not tiny. Tiny, not tiny. Tiny. Uh, let's just stick with uh, probably, I don't know, 55. Head size. Massive. Oh, my God. <laughs> Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. That's amazing. That is absolutely amazing. I look like a freaking... Wait, hold on. <laughs> let's, uh, let's see. What else? Leg separation? Oh, yes. Uh, what about neck thickness? No, not that. Uh, nose size all the way out. Uh, ears all the way up. Um, lower muscle. Let's make legs big. Chest size big. Leg size. Whoa! <laughs> I look like a carno. <laughs> Ah, this is ridiculous, uh, but it's cool though. I, I like I like being able to do silly goofy things like that right off the bat without having to have some kind of a modded thing. Okay, let's get a little bit more serious with this. The base character actually looked pretty good already. Leg size, let's just take it to like, I don't know, 55. Uh, eye size, no. I th Okay, this head is really jacking with me. Let's go back down to 50%. That's pretty good. The arms, let's... Uh, Let's take the arms back up. Whoa. Okay. Yeah, that's that's not going to work either. Uh, I'm thinking 50% is good. Just a standard normal character, because otherwise this is ridiculous. <laughs> uh, let's just go. I don't know. That? Sure. That's that's fine. Neck thickness. Uh, okay. All right. Yeah, 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 yeah. That'll work. What about arm? Huh. Upper muscle? Whoa. Okay, cool. I think... I mean, I think we're uh, pretty good with this. Uh, leg size, let's just take it down to 55%. That's fine. Lower muscle. Take that... Nah, that's fine. We can we can leave it up. Chin position? Uh, yeah. Like somewhere in there. Eve size. What is the Eve size? I don't know what that is, and I can't really wait. Uh, no, mm, no, I don't really see a difference. 
Okay, we'll just leave that at zero then. I think that's pretty good. Uh, lower muscle. Yeah, mouth size. Like that. Neck thickness. We'll just take it back down just a little bit. Okay, all right, cool. I mean, that's that's pretty basic. That's uh, pretty standard stats, but I'm okay with that. I, th I think it ends up looking really, really good right off the bat. Chin position, all that stuff, eye size. Oh, I, I the Y was cut off, <laughs> so <laughs> I couldn't see that until just now. <laughs> oh man, I'm an idiot. Okay, that makes a lot more sense now. All right, I think we're good. Let's go ahead and create. Well, yeah, that's better. Okay, that's more proportionate. Let's go ahead and create a character. And then I want to host a game. Okay, all right, we are in the world. This is fantastic. Uh, let's see, there's a whole lot of hotkeys is what it looks like. One through, can I use the scroll wheel? It does not look like I can use the scroll wheel. Uh, is that a setting I can actually change? Okay, uh, F1 for help, F3 keyboard. Oh, tooltips. There's the compass up top. Okay, I see that. Lower setting, improves performance. Uh, there's the character window down below. A whole bunch of stuff. Health, air, stamina, thirst, and hunger. On the right-hand side, that makes sense. We've got crafting and building with the hammer and the nail. That makes sense. Inventory. We've got social animations. Oh, cool. In a tribe and a group. Okay. All right. How do I get rid of that? Uh, F3? Oh, okay. All right. That's that's really, really cool. So we've got all the Fs. Uh, I wonder if we can remap these. That'd be really cool if I could. So we've got hot bar selection slots, one through four. E is the action. P is push and talk. F is mount, crouch, milk. Mi what? What? We can milk things? <laughs> that's amazing. Uh, feed animals and pets. The cursor on and off is escape tab is UI and cursor. Shift, sprint, activate animal wings needed to fly mounts. Okay, follow, stop, tame pets. Cool. Now, let's get rid of this on here. Let's hit tab and see what that gives me. I don't have to hold it. That's great. And then how do I get rid of the chat window? I guess I can't. Okay, we'll figure this out. Unless there's an escape key, which doesn't look like there actually is. Okay, all right. We're going to be able to do this. I promise. Tab it. All right, we're learning already. Great. So what do I need to do? I mean, the first thing, whoa, whoa, whoa. Holy crap, it's a T-Rex. Okay, we need to get the heck out of here. Uh, what is that thing? Can it see me? I sure hope not. Oh, oh God. Okay, please be uh, peaceful. I need to punch a tree. That's like the first survival rule of every single survival game ever. Punch a tree, punch a rock, get the stuff. Pretty self-explanatory, right? Okay. All right, that's got to be one of those horrendous mythical creatures that it was talking about. Huh. Okay. All right, I'll just punch. I gathered sticks. A lucky lime, a log, a waving leaf. He didn't even hear me. Great. Great. We're not even going to mess with him. Let's get out of here. Let's punch this thing. Straw, lucky lime, stick, straw, stick, straw, logs. Great. There's another dino over here. I wonder if this is uh, a bad one. Oh, what is this? A golden pepper. I got a golden pepper, baby. Yeah. Oh my God, it's elephants. This music though. What the heck is that thing? And that, there's another T-Rex over there. I need to avoid those guys with all costs. Can I actually craft any sort of weapons or anything like that? Let's go to the building. Okay, where's, where's the building? Oh, that makes sense. So we've got tools. We've got a heavy metal axe. We need metal and level two. Okay, stone hatchet. We need two more logs for that. Pickaxe. We need four more logs to do both of those. We need stone and we need level two. How do I get to level two? What about weapons? Oh, wow. 
There's a there's a revolver, assault rifle, shotgun, hunting rifle, spirit soul, ancient rune, aqua soul, evil eye axe. Interesting. I, I, I don't know what any of this stuff is. We've got a helmet. We have to be level four for that. All right, so this is going to be a pretty interesting start so far. Uh, let's go over here by these elephants. That guy looks like bad news. I'm not going to go over there. Not right now. Not until I'm prepared. Or at least I feel more prepared. Got another log. Now, where do I get rocks from? I got a power prayer? Interesting. Oh my god, look how cute. They look so small. <laughs> Hello, elephant male, level four. I like your animations. Your animations are so cool. Are, are you mad at me? Let's hope not. Can I interact with you? I'm pressing E, right on your tail. Is not doing anything? No, it's not, okay. What about your buddy? What level are you? Are you a female? Now, there is taming in here. No, you're level five, male. Whoa, 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 whoa! Hold on, hoss. What are you doing? I'm just a friendly naked guy running around in the forest. Why are you getting so mad at me? At least he's not chasing me. I don't even know if he was actually mad. That might have just been their animation. It's better be safe than sorry. There's something on top of that hill over there, but there's a T-Rex between me and it. Which makes me a little bit concerned. There's also what appears to be rocks down there by the water. And I need those in order to craft some of the basic tools. Because I can't just punch this. Or can I? Oh, double to... Oh, double punch, baby. Can I left punch? No, I can't. Hmm. Well, if the aggro range is really low, I shouldn't have to worry about it. Oh my god. That's a Carno. That's not a T-Rex. It's beautiful. There's another... What is this? Green apples. Some Granny Smith apples. I don't know who doesn't like Granny Sn Smith apples, especially in a survival environment like this. More trees. Cool. There's the beach down there. The water, though. That water is gorgeous. We found it. I have no idea what this thing is, though. What is this? <gasps> it's a city! Are you kidding me? That's amazing. Is this some kind of watchtower? Oh, hold on. Can I loot this? Can I climb this? Can I jump? I can jump, but I can't get in this thing. What about crouch? No! Dang it, I was hoping I could get in there. I wonder if they're friendly. I still don't have any stones, but there's a rock over there. Hmm. Am I crouched? I am crouched. I don't see any other rocks. Uh, ugh, this could be interesting. Let's go ahead and tab it. Gotta be level six. Okay, that's not gonna happen. We've got tools, stone hatchet. I can craft one of those. Let's go ahead and do that. The pickaxe. I need... What else do I need? I need level two. And I need stones. That's right. But I got the... What? Oh, I don't even have... Okay, that makes more sense. That makes a lot more sense. The chat window. I gotta get this thing off the screen. Clear. Chat. C. No. Not chat. Uh, let's bring up, uh, this thing again. How do I get the chat off the screen? It doesn't say. Okay. Alright, but I did just get a hatchet, so that's good. Uh, where can I get it from? Here we go. Slot number one. Oh my god, yes. Alright, I'm gonna be prepared. Uh, can I deselect it? Yeah. Let's see if they're mad at me. Okay, they're mad at me. Die, you little gremlin. Oh god. Run, 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 run. This was a bad idea. How's my health? Health is okay ish. Uh, let's just keep running. Stamina. Watch my stamina. Oh, it's another one. Crap. Let's get some more stone. Get some stone. Come on, give me some stone. Stone. I need a lot. I'm a lot bigger than you and taller than you. Oh, you guys. Ha! <laughs> you can't get me. The other guys, their aggro range is so small. Okay. All right. You know what we're just going to do? We're just going to mine this. Oh, crap. 
You're a gremlin. Wait, let's just get out of the aggro range. It's gonna make things a lot easier. Uh, this way? Okay. Alright. <laughs> oh boy, I don't know what that is. Oh, we're good. We're totally fine. Let's do, uh, weapons. Wooden spear? Wooden spear. Let's craft that. What else is over here? Equipment. What level am I? I think I'm only level one, to be honest with you. That's crazy. Uh, let's... I don't know. We need to start making a structure, but I really want to go in here and loot. If I can get those horses or those cows or something, that's going to be good. Hopefully, this spear is going to help me out quite a bit as well. But I don't know. Okay, we got a spear. Where's that gremlin? It's starting to get what appears to be nighttime as well. Come here. Come here. Die! What? what? Oh! Oh! Uh, how, how am I supposed to do this? I, I can't attack him! Oh, there we go! Oh, I- Oh, oh my god! <laughs> I speared him! Uh... Loot? Can I not get my spear back? Or did I get my spear back? I think I did! Nice! Where's that other guy? Those were those were level six, right? You know what? I'm curious to see. I mean, they're all the way over there. Okay. Whoa! That was loud. Gaul's tribe village. Anything in here? No. Nothing in here. Okay, what 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 does this thing do? Is that just the animation for this place? Uh press M to milk you. <laughs> I picked up milk. Uh Oh, dang it. I was going to try and milk the horse. Oh, I have an unlimited spears. Oh, yes. That's fantastic. But it does have a durability thing. How straight is this? Oh, you done, son? <laughs> okay. All right. This, uh... I, I'm starting to get the hang of this. Can I... Can I milk you? Press F to mount. Can I milk this horse? Okay, good. Good. I was hoping that I couldn't do that. But I got a horse! Now, how does this thing work? You're not very fast. Doesn't look like you've got some kind of an over-encumbered thing, either. Okay. I've got a horse now. Wait, hold on a second. Uh, is F dismount as well? Are you going to run off? Whoa, buddy! <laughs> I guess they just uh, continually respawn, I suppose. Interesting, which means I need to get out of here. But what I wanted to check out and see... Can I actually loot this guy this way? Huh! Very interesting. Very interesting indeed. It doesn't look, look like I can. Is there anything else I can craft? I have to be level 2. I'm still not level 2. Okay, well, you know what I'm going to try and do? I'm going to try and get to level 2. See how well this works. I need to make a torch. It looks like it's getting nighttime. I need to explore a little bit. I haven't seen anything that says that there's a map here. So that could be very interesting. Here, Oh, here's the settings. Okay. So the global volume, I'm going to go ahead and turn that down. Because that was super, super loud. Music volume. 50%. Shadow distance, no. We're good with that. Let's do four and then two. Oh, they're back up. Okay. All right. I need to, uh... Yeah. Do better about this. World. Global volume. Let's do that. Beautiful. Apply. Back. Cool. Now, that's that tab. Whoa, 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 whoa! What just happened? Where did this take me to? 
I just teleported. How the heck did I teleport? Uh, F3? <laughs> what? What was that button? No, it's F1, right? That is the unstuck go home button. So this is my home. That's that's what this is. Huh. Very interesting. Okay. All right. Well, you know what? It's starting to get nighttime. I need to get some sticks. There's that big guy. I do still have a spear, so I should be okay with that. As soon as I get to level two, I should be able to start doing some more things. And I'm curious to see how some of these building pieces come together, because that's something I always look for in a new survival game. How well do the buildings work? Wow, I didn't realize my character, his legs were as big as he was, or as they are. Huh. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Okay, so that's 10 sticks and 10 logs for some stairs. Pillars are two logs. Doors made from branches are 10 sticks and five logs. These are all very doable things. So it looks like I can go ahead and build a house. All right, let me go ahead and get out of here, make a torch, kind of get to a safe area, start grabbing some more materials, go back, get my horse, and then I'll be right back. Well, I've discovered a couple things. One, this map is actually pretty darn big. Uh, the second thing is that it's taking some getting used to on some of the controls and things like that. It's a little bit different than some of the other games. So right down here, we've got my thirst and we've got my hunger. Now I found some, uh, some corn, some sweet corn. The problem is if I try and put it on my hot bar, same thing with this milk, I can't actually utilize it. So if I right click, left click, E, whoa, oh, oh, I just figured it out. Okay, well, you know, I was wrong. I was mistaken. <laughs> I figured if we just clicked it, it would use it. It doesn't, you have to actually press E. That's cool. That's not bad. I can definitely get used to that. But the other, I thought you had to go into the actual inventory to be able to grab. Whoa, did I just drop that? I didn't mean to drop that. Uh, okay, can I find it? Hello? I just threw bananas on the ground. Dang it! I need that. <laughs> I really needed that. Okay, well, let's, uh, let's go ahead and drink a little bit. Oh, we're good there. Let's grab a little bit more food. If I can make a campfire, that's going to be helpful. Okay. All right. I'm getting a little bit distracted here. Let's get this. Let's go ahead and keep farming up a little bit more trees. Uh, also, another thing that I've noticed is that quite a few of the creatures are super aggressive. You would think a trike would be friendly. No, a trike is not friendly. <laughs> a trike wants to rip my face off. A uh, good thing is with the aggro range being as low as it is, I don't really have to worry about that, especially now that I stole a horse from the little gremlins. And it doesn't seem to run away, which is super good. Okay, I'm getting closer. Getting closer. I wonder if I can actually go ahead and start crafting a couple of these building pieces. I think I can. Uh, let's go to buildings. Foundations, branches. Whoa! That was interesting. Okay, uh, is this where I want to actually build? I mean, it, it's not a horrible... You know what? Let's go over here where it's a little bit flatter. Can I raise it up? Doesn't look like I can raise it up at all. Let's place it. Oh, it's just... Oh, okay. So we just select it and it builds whatever I want it to. You don't have all the required materials. Oh, you know what I like, though? When you're standing and looking down, even though it's not above the grass, you don't see the grass. That's neat. Okay, well, let's just keep gathering a little bit more things. How expensive was that? How many trees does it take to get one foundation? Let's open up the foundations, branches, four logs, and 15 sticks. Okay. I got three sticks so far and two logs. Three sticks and two logs for a small tree. Are these bigger trees any different? Okay, so that's two logs, one stick, three logs. Oh, so it's random. It's completely random. Huh, interesting. I don't think I have enough yet. Let's go back to the buildings. Oh, uh, well, I might. Let's go back over here. Can I build another one? No, I can't. I don't have all the resources. Okay, cool. But it looks like right-click cancels that action. Nice. Now let's grab my horse, 
bring him over here because I don't I haven't noticed any of the creatures roaming around the place, which is good. Uh, but I still kind of want to see and be careful just because you can never be too careful when it comes to games like this. OK, now something else I noticed the others planks, cloth, jungle, silk, brick, brown, bear fur, hardened, Nordic bear fur, mortar, clay, whole bunch of stuff. A watchtower. I can just make a watchtower. <laughs> I have to be level 16, though. So that's pretty cool. A flaw. Whoa, no. You're kidding, right? This rug can fly if your imagination is wild enough to believe it can. That is amazing. Oh, my gosh. That is crazy. Absolutely crazy. I also picked up these spears, the iron spear, I guess from those gremlins. I didn't realize that they were actually giving me stuff because it wasn't in their loot thing. But maybe I just, maybe it was when I was hitting them, trying to uh, get some of their stuff. I don't know. I am curious, though, to see how easy it is to upgrade some of my weapons. I mean, I'm getting closer. I probably need to take on one of these bigger creatures. Ooh, there's the trike back that way. I don't know, though. I don't know. There was those low-level elephants. That would be cool. And then there's something else right over there. I didn't even see that. Oh, God, I'm glad I didn't go over there. Wow. Well, guys, I'm almost level two, and I still can't actually make a staircase. <laughs> I think... This might be a little bit uh, skewed. They might, my personal recommendation would be that they changed a little bit of the requirements or at least the gather rate or something like that. Or maybe if you're doing a single player thing like I'm doing, you could actually go and, and change those settings. I'm sure that's going to pop up at some point, but I was thinking here I was going to build a house and I, I don't really think I'm going to do that. Uh, let's go ahead and I still don't have all the required materials, 10 logs and 10 sticks. So, it's a little bit off. Um, that's okay. I mean, hey, guys, it's pre-beta. This stuff, this, this is how games are developed. It's through trial and error. Hey, I reached level two, baby. Finally. <laughs> nice little 360 spin there. Now, why am I getting the aggro music? Oh, God, let's get the spear out. Uh, my horse has somehow disappeared. I had to log off and then log back on. And for some reason... Um, the horse isn't here anymore. I honestly thought I was about to lose everything that I had. But fortunately, I didn't, except for the horse. I mean, that's okay. Uh, I know where one is, but I'm a little bit further away from there than I would have liked to be. So I'm worried that this isn't going to be considered as my home unless it is. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, the music went away, so that's good. Did my health points go up? Oh, I'm sure it did, but I forgot to look. Dang. What is this? That's salt. Okay, what is this? Sand? We've got some raw meat. I can eat it. Why well, I can eat it raw. That's awesome. What about this? The waving leaf restores five to five health. Okay. All right. This is uh, this is pretty neat. Let me go ahead and see how many sticks and logs I have. I've got 55 logs and nine sticks. Aye, aye, aye. Okay. <laughs> One more tree <laughs> so I can finally get this staircase made. And of course, all I get are logs and straw. Oh, wow. Stick! I finally did it, guys. <laughs> I made it. Amazing. Let's jump back over here. Okay. All right. Cool, cool, cool. We got some wooden stairs. Excellent. Place it right there. Bam! That looks amazing. I like the detail work on this. It's, it's nice. It's nice. Obviously, things are definitely going to change. But you know what, guys? I'm going to end this episode off, my little playthrough, with attacking a trike. I, it should still be over here. I don't think I'm going to survive this. I'm probably going to get my face wrecked in. Uh, but that's okay. So let me go ahead and go over here, find this trike, see what the combat's like for a bigger... Oh, my God. Even better. Let's kill this guy. Uh, what's the range like? Nope. Miss. Swing and a miss. A swing and a miss. I like it's 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 got a little bit of drop. I like that. Okay. Okay, maybe I. Huh. Maybe I gotta get closer. Oh, I'm definitely hitting him. I'm definitely hitting this ugly mug. Oh boy. Okay. All right. All right. <laughs> Let's do this. Okay. All right. All right. What's, oh, level 50, oh boy. Why am I, 
No, no, go, run, Mace, run. Oh, you, oh boy, okay. All right. <laughs> He's gonna murder my face. He's 100% gonna murder my face. All these spikes, this is great, this is great. Oh boy, okay. Oh, run, 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 run. I'm gonna fall off the cliff. I'm gonna fall off the cliff. <laughs> oh boy, okay. All right, can I just keep running? Okay, all right. Spear in the face. Oh, it broke, oh God, uh, okay. Let's run over here. Bob and weave, baby, bob and weave. Running through the forest. Are you gonna get stuck, you stupid idiot? Oh, you are super, super slow. Uh, let's let's test something really quick. Uh, uh, grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it. Oh boy, tab, get out of here. Am I, am I about to kill this thing? I think I'm about to kill this thing. Am I gonna do this? Oh, come on, music. Get super hype for me. He's about, oh my God. I feel like I shouldn't be able to do this at level two. I killed him. I killed him. <laughs> that was amazing. Uh, what is that purple thing? Can I, can I loot? What do you have on you? A lenipi, a well, oh, I'm, I'm sorry, what? <laughs> well, a peeny wall, okay. I have no idea what this is. Uh, let's put it in slot number seven. And what is this? Hardened leather. Wow. That was amazing. Uh, you know, I am curious though. Can I actually harvest from you? Is that how I got those spears before? You must be like a rock golem. I'm going to harvest your back, <laughs> I guess. Okay, I don't think I'm actually getting anything from him. Nope, I didn't. I still have no idea where I got those spears from because I can't make spears uh, because I have no copper. Can I make anything else? I don't think I really can. The epic battle music is still here. There's some really cool stuff, but guys, I'm going to go ahead and call this the end of the episode, the end of the playthrough. Oh my God. What is this? I can't even. Well, you know what? We'll just place it. Oh, that's cool. Can it stack on top of each other? I don't really know how to rotate. Deactivate building pieces and placeables. I move up and down to increase, decrease flying height. Uh, I don't see a rotate thing. I don't see it. Okay, well, you know what? Can we place it on top like this? Is, can it float? It can float. Oh, that's actually kind of neat. Uh, so the structure part is not, uh, it's not like normal, but you know what? That's, could be, could be a blessing in disguise. Can I climb up this thing? No, I didn't build it high enough. Okay. All right. Interesting. Very, very interesting. But you know what, guys? I'm going to go ahead and call this the end of the playthrough. I know I've tried to say that like five times already, and I keep getting distracted because this game has a lot of potential. But anyways, I'm officially calling this the end of the playthrough. Got a lot of potential pre-beta. It's going, it's going pretty good. It's going pretty good. All right, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.